York. Easy. You have to be a waiter in New York. Yeah, but how do I start being a waiter in New York? Well, you have to have experience being a waiter in New York. And you're like, <laughs> but how do I become a waiter? And they're like, you just have to be one. You have to be born a waiter. Do you subscribe to casting networks first? Or do you or do you apply for a restaurant first to be right? Yeah, I gotta say. I, <laughs> I better start seeing I better book some of this, I better book some of this background work, bro. Or that was a easy three hundo they got for yeah. no reason. We're live, everybody. Hey, if you want to talk about Nintendo powers, come to us, not next lander. Let me know when we go not live. So as we I was are. saying, my We're social live. is one five. <laughs> what? <laughs> uh hey folks, I'm Brian McGinnis. That's TJ Del Reno. How'd you guess? That's me. Did you ever go by TJ Del Reno 911? No. I used you to have my I used to have my anime alias. Which is? Was uh Victorio Cole. Oh, that's right. I've heard of that. Is my that's anime alias. alias. So we're gonna dive into the 21st issue of Nintendo Power. The legal drinking age of Nintendo Power. Right. None of the fan mail people can drink except maybe one old grandma. Every now and then. Oh, who loves her Nintendo? <laughs> Why don't you make it a magazine with large font? Let me ask you, have you ever spilled mucilix on a Nintendo controller and does milk ruin the paddle? I spilled milk on my paddle. Did you call them uh, controllers, joysticks, or paddles? Oh, people definitely call them paddles or I joysticks. Hate it. I hate it, it when my controller. Like, oh. So, yeah, could you give me the paddle? I was like, yeah. what are you talking about? Joystick 2 is funny because, like, I, I had joysticks for my Atari and computer, my Commodore, but nope, Nintendo is definitely a controller. So, any hoozle, we're going to talk about the uh, Star Tropics issue number 21. Oh, what a boring cover. <laughs> what a boring as shit cover this is. Is the movie big at the bottom? <laughs> right? Okay, so Star Tropics. Do you have keyboard um, beaches? I don't know much about this game. Six. I've started. I've played like five minutes of Star Trek. Well, I remember when they, when they put on the Nintendo Switch online, people were like Star Trek is awesome. I'm like, oh, let me try it. I'm like, oh, it's just a regular, it's just another fucking RPG, you know. Uh, there's there, there's like a fat man, like your uncle's like a fat naked dude. You got to save yeah. or something like that. Um, but let's see what this is. Is this a drawing, or is it like paper mache? A drawing. <laughs> what do you think this is? I don't. I think this is paper mache. I think it's like actually. A physical thing. I I don't think this is a drawing. Right? What what say you? Are you still there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm <laughs> so, so I'm looking at my my monitor has it up, so then I could also see like yeah, the whole thing. You, you could look at this too. Uh I don't know. I, mean, I can see better on my monitor. You okay. know, for some reason it's clear on my Mac with you through the stream than the image is on my monitor with the website. Well, there you go. It's crazy. I don't understand. Like, I guess my resolution's bad. It looks like not paper mache, but maybe like m like collage, construction paper. I don't know. Yeah, maybe it's something like that. I just don't um, understand, dude. I don't get. I just where the key the keyboard. I don't understand. Yeah. So it's Star Tropics, perils in paradise. So it's just a bird. It's a fucking bird. There's a, oh, what, there's a bird with a skull on his head. That's kind of cool, actually. I mean, um, that is cool. Yeah, but yeah, there's an evil-looking starfish. But yeah, there's a, the piano. I don't... It doesn't say much at all about this game. No. If you asked me, I thought it'd be like a Jamaican music bird game. I'd be like, all right, cool. I guess you're a, I guess you're a Jamaican... I guess you're a bird in the Caribbean making music? Yeah, like if you had okay, if you, if you didn't know, which I still don't really know, I just know it's an RPG. What I have, I have no idea what I would think this is. No, no, I'm telling you, I would think, yeah, it was, yeah, I would think it's a music sim, and I wouldn't even. Can I tell you, I would put this issue on the pain no mind list? I would just be like, mm, I, no, it might, maybe, yeah, start. I would think it's probably something with space, just because start like jungle space beach i mean i i would th no i would idea. i would think that the, that maybe aliens land and make the birds musical because you see star tropics there's like a comet whooshing yeah i see that that's interesting it's weird man i don't know but don't miss team nt2 the arcade game and i think we gotta be quest. two bold bald white shirt boys we are it's too hot in here brian it's hot right. it's hot as hell Plus Game Boy Round Ball Roundup. So, you know, the starfish look deadly. The skull, the skull ostrich is what makes me think like that. This, you looks, know, this looks very, 
Looks very Monkey Islandish, actually. This yeah, I'm, yeah, like that would freak. Then I'm like, why is there a dinosaur bird? But like, it, none of it piques my interest because there's a giant cockatoo, huge, huge cockatoo or three. Like, why is there a parrot on the cut? Like, why is the parrot the the Main focal folk. point? Is a parrot? There's no you. You don't play as a parrot, I believe. No, you play as a boy with his fat uncle, right? Yeah, and there's not a single. So where's the boy in. and his fat uncle in the? In, I guess in the submarine. Maybe they drowned. I don't know. No, it's one eyeball. Did it's one. Uh, yeah, it's one eyeball. It's not a person. It's very strange. You, know, you know, they they're keeping the tradition of weird ass covers. Ryan, you're like they drowned. It. They choked on Pischetti. Yeah. <laughs> so I think it's paper machete. Or I do, I do paper. think I do think they made they physically made this. What a huge waste of time that <laughs> is. Yeah, or um, or like I said, maybe those are Microsoft Paint or a or a... now look at those trees in the background. That looks like it's cut out of like construction paper, doesn't it? Yeah, I can't believe the... the resolution's better on my computer. Someone's yeah. like, someone's like, check out this bird I made. Like, wow, you spent how long on this parrot? I guess we got to put on the main cover now. I always wonder if any of the Nintendo Power people like like the uh... played played games. Well, <laughs> <laughs> well, like. You know, I, I just I wonder the point of like, do they ever see the cover and go like, oh, do they ever see the cover and go like this? Oh, the fuck! Like they had, that? To, they had to be like, what the? Fuck? They had to with this one. Like, oh, what what is this? And then they're like, you know, and then they got mad at an intern being like, did you? What did you tell them the game was about? And they're like, yeah, I just yeah. Said it was an island, right? And uh, it's a tr you said it was a tropical resort with birds. I didn't say that. You know, yeah, yeah. Wait, why happened. is there a skeleton ostrich? I, uh, I told him one of the enemies was uh, uh... <laughs> so I, I have the box art documented, which is actually really interesting. A skeleton, yeah. So, and there's there's times when the design the artist would barely get any information about the game, hence Mega Man One, like, hence, like yeah, Mega Man One, you know. So, and there are other times where it's like I had almost no information to go off, I had a couple screenshots from the game, and they had to think of what the and they they like draw the box art from that, you know. So, this may be. This seems like it kind of like when you look at the original cover of Star Tropics, there's a comet flying down and there's just a picture of an island with a with a, like like it's very boring. It is. I mean, like, it's just it's just an island. I'm going to bring that up, too. Let's like, see. It's just it, it's just an island as a Star Tropics and a test of island courage. You can buy it for fourteen ninety nine. Um, But yeah, you're right. It's not. There's no birds. It's just it looks this this looks like a Sim C type thing, I would think. Look at this guy. Put a put a goddamn shirt on. Dude, hold on, who you got? I don't know. The fat, the fat uncle's friend. Yeah, but I'm, it looks more like uh this looks like a sim, like a Sim City type game. Anyway. Yeah, right. It just it just doesn't it's dumb. It's a very boring box art. So this cover is more interesting than the box art. Yeah. And almost makes me want to play the game more than the box art. Because if I saw this on the cover, I'm like, the hell is this? But then, of course, <laughs> when you play it, and all of a sudden, the, you wake up on your fat uncle's island. And it's like, all right, now you got to go solve the island mystery. And yeah. I'd be like, oh, this sucks. Where's the skeleton ostrich? Yeah. Well, there you go. Let's dive in. Let's I mean, see. there's nothing oh. else. Oh, my God. Yes. What the? Radicalize. Radicalize. What a great. They, they were like, we thought of a cool word. You want to know what it is? radicalize your what year game. was this again 91 all right 15 like, bucks again, like this is like where the punk it was like the you know like the 90s like ska yeah every yeah radical ska punk i mean it's just why does he have like demon hands oh oh yeah was this a poster yeah it must have been like probably when you fold it up in the cover fold it out twice you know what i mean reach yeah. out and look at his now. look at uh scroll over look at his um flare Look at his Friday's yeah. flare. Yeah, he's got a bunch. He's got an airplane. He's got a globe. He's got know. a crab hand. He's got the hand. So this, so fifteen bucks a year. You got to think three fifty cover price. Pretty good deal. You might as well subscribe, for kids. You know. I mean, you might as well, yeah. Or remember, you, your parents had to use a credit card where they did the kachunk with it. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, unmask. Yeah, I don't know why he's unmasked. Oh, this is why unmask the power animal. In oh, unmask you. the power animal in you, Look and that's who it is. Busy font, everything is just like ah, just screaming at these. I kids. mean, that's what the '90s were. Was everything was screaming? Every it, everything was colorful, bright, and all right, screaming. All right, all right, ready? Hold on. Look, we have radicalized your game. Mm -hmm. with a subscription. We have 
unleash the power animal in you. And then we got superheat your skills with molten power. Mm, Plus we got gosh. get massive doses of power. Oh my God. Like they score power now to the right. The, yeah. So they, they definitely, it was like drug pushers. They couldn't cut anything and edit. There's like, put it all in. <laughs> it's all so good. We can't cut anything. Yeah. Yeah. It's Everyone's like, we're, we're gonna we're gonna take out the power animal in you, and someone's it's and the Clifford same... Clifford was like, oh, and they're it's like, the all right, same we'll keep that in. Thing every time, it's ridiculous. It's so bad. Flip down. Oh, so, okay. So flip down yeah. to unmask. So you flip that down, and then you get this fucking kid. That's what it yeah. was. Yeah. Then you get the then you get all the right. animal. Yeah, using animal. <laughs> My God. Ugh, penis nose. Ugh. Yeah, that guy's got a big. Sh- Honk of a cock penis. <laughs> oh boy, this is uh, this month's feature. We take we turn you on to our power meters. It is annoying that Nestor scene. really is their mascot that he's got to be like peppered all over the magazine. He's everywhere. Well, you know, they have to do something. So, what is this? Is his turtles too? Yep, boom, arcade action at home. The pizza power turtles return to make streets and sewers safe for all. It's the arcade classic, only better. Uh, no, it's not. It was not better than the arcade. It was good, but it wasn't better. It's only better because you can play at home. Right. More gremlins. We had that last time. Star Tropics again. Magician. Abu. Ultima. A lot of bad games and so on. Good thing. Uh, good thing Turtles 2 is in here to I'll really tell you, capture. Brian, with bad covers comes bad games. <laughs> Celebrity profile we got. All right, here we go. Let's dive into mailbox. Game Boy faster than a speeding bullet. Oh my god, some kid got shot, but his I hope yeah, please his game boy. shot his game. Boy. I was I was on a very boring four hour drive from Jersey Shore, PA to Pasadena, MD. What? Jersey Shore to Maryland is not four hours. No, no, it's no. Like, so I think about... so I think they went from the Jersey from the Jersey Shore to Pennsylvania to Pasadena to Maryland. No, I, I think he's, this kid's just an idiot. Um, I decided to whip out my Game Boy. I was playing Tetris, and all of a sudden, screech! My dad slammed on the brakes. There was an accident ahead, and he was a little too quick to apply at applying the brakes. Otherwise, we could have been dead. <laughs> the, mo- the momentum tore the Game Boy from my hands and out the side window. That's not true. Yeah, and number one, if your dad hits the brakes, your Thank momentum him. you're going to throw the Game Boy forward, not so, sideways out the window. So, like. Y- y- it's why do they just have liars right hold on this, here's what i think it is i think this article was written the kid goes my dad um, oh my oh my goodness my dad hit the brakes and then my game boy flew out of my hands in the car and then i had cake like he punched i also don't bit. know how to get to pennsylvania to california it's a four-hour drive i'm a stupid child and then the idiots that work at nintendo power were like we got to beef this up so then they just because you don't throw it out. They, the, took, they it, took some liberties. <laughs> they took tons of. If you told me that it flew out the passenger side window, I'd be like, "All right, he he it it flew out, went between the seat and the window, and then flew out the passenger." He, I'd be like, "Okay, is he part dog? Is he sticking his whole head out the window when he drives down the highway?" I don't understand. Beep as it flew over the bank for me. Hold on, hold on. Let's go out of the car and flying over the railing. Like, no, you're not. It, it was the last time I made it as I flew down, down, down over the bank. Before I flew, I, I was out of the car. Co- Wait, what? Before my family or I knew what I was doing, I was out of the car and flying over the railing. I've never moved so fast. You fucking liar. While we waited about an hour for the accident to clear, my sister and I looked for the Game Boy. Finally, I faintly heard the music of the Tetris. To my surprise, when I recovered my Game Boy, it didn't have a scratch on it. The rest of, of the course. way to Maryland... I had a tight grip. Jersey Shore to Maryland is literally 45 minutes. Jersey Shore to Maryland? Oh, yeah. yeah. It's not four hours, Jim. Where's Pasadena? Pasadena is not in Maryland either, I don't think. Nice launch, Jim. If the, oh, my God. If the Soviet cosmonauts had already, hadn't already taken their Game Boys into orbit, you might have had a record. What a weird response. Pasadena, Maryland. All right. Where is it? It's short Pennsylvania. Hey, look at that. Bald Baltimore. But what okay, Jim Willits. Yeah, so Jersey Shore, which might be Wildwood. Then they went through Pennsylvania. Then they went to Pasadena, Maryland. So Jersey Shore. I just said we don't need here's the thing that confuses me about this whole thing and why I wish this kid's Game Boy fell on a homeless man's like tent, and then the homeless guy like choked throat choked through him. <laughs> 
why are you all you have to say you stupid idiot is you went from jersey shore to pasadena maryland why did you add pennsylvania we don't need to know that do you mean yeah so i found where where he went and i guess like you know i found a jim willis in chicago maybe. <sighs> I love that you look these people up. He, it's just such a lie. It's such a stupid, it's stupid letter. He it's jumped out of the car. Uh, really? Come on. Come on, kid. All right. So I wonder oh, where he was because he wasn't in. That's all right. We don't need Seaside to Heights to Pasadena. I mean, he was. I don't know what Jersey Shore he was in. Seaside Heights is three hours. Pasadena and then. Whatever. Let's move on. It's not important. I wish we Holy, could. Even Holy Asbury, Asbury, bro. This kid does not want to know where the Jersey Shore is, bro. No. Well, also, Jersey Shore, says, PA. It's Jersey Shore, Pennsylvania. That's not a thing. It's not a real it, thing. It, it is. I looked it up, but it does say Jersey Shore, Shore, Pennsylvania. Yeah, very stupid. Shut right? up. Yeah. You shut up. Borough in Lycoming County, Pennsylvania. It's on the West Branch, Susquehanna River. <gasps> shut up. Pretty stupid. Oh, my God. That's so stupid. Either way, this kid's a liar. Oh my right, god! Let's, he, let's move what on. We gotta, let's move on. It's too much. Too much in this. We gotta move on. Also, he said they're talking about cosmonauts. Problematic. The yeah. optics aren't good. True. Another indestructible. Holy NES Batman. Is this another one where I was driving in the car playing my Nintendo on my minivan TV? My dad <laughs> right. didn't break too hard. Let's see. Oh, I read that you wanted to hear about disasters. Well, my life. Sit down for this one. You ready for this? <laughs> oh, my life should be a reality show. Well, I have a good one for you. It started when my family moved. I put my NES in its box to be moved with the rest of, your, of our stuff. When the truck arrived at our new house, I ran out and immediately started to dig for my NES. To my amazement, a chair had fallen and the leg was stuck in the NES box. When I saw it, I freaked out. I opened it up and it looked terrible. There was a big hole punched in the top of my control deck. I cleaned out the broken plastic and put in Super Mario Brothers 2. And wow, it worked. You can see the game pack through the hole, but it works fine. <sighs> That's fine. These are all like it works fine. Look at this. Warning. When moving, avoid placing chairs loaded with heavy objects on top of your control dick. Holes caused by chair legs are not considered normal wear and tear and are not covered by warranty. Well, they can repair it, they said. Look at that phone. Look. You, you, yeah, but they're saying he's got to pay. Jeez, what a shit. Like, sorry, kid. You're shit out of luck. Old lady. So here's a good one. Old lady scores. You want to read this one? Where? Next one. Old lady scores. Oh, this is enough. We were just joking about this. Yeah, yeah, go for it. I wanted to drop you a line and let you know what a help Nintendo Power is. The Super Mario Brothers 3 strategy guide was my first issue. It arrived just in time with its help. I beat Koopa. My husband's dead. <laughs> I purchased a few back issues at the local toy store. I'm writing because I noticed that most of the items were by young kids. Nintendo, young kids, <laughs> strange. <laughs> when I got when I got my hands when I got my arthritic hands <laughs> on the November December 1989 issue, it, I was delighted to see the poem by 75 year old Willem Coventry. I don't know Mr. C, but he's my kind of grandpa. <laughs> I'm getting oh. very moist. <laughs> I want to know that all my friends are in their mid. What? I want you to know that all my friends are in their mid twenties and older. Who was okay. hanging out with an old lady? Well, she never really said how old she is yet. Keep going. Uh, <sighs> and then, and those of us who have kids play NES video games more than the kids do. A lot of your readers are adults and proud of it. A funny thing happened to me when I received Tetris for Christmas last year. I became tetris -sized. One day I stopped at the corner store to get a Pepsi product. For a nickel. For a nickel. I saw I the arcade some... Tetris game there, and I couldn't help myself. I dropped in a quarter and began playing, not really noticing the kids playing next to me. After I completed four or five Tetrads in a row, the oh, boys began loser. The boys Just calling began it that watching me play. <laughs> <laughs> I started getting very excited and wanted the boys to come over and touch my knickers. After I completed four, I set a high score in the machine the first time I finished. One boy turned to the other two and said, wow, check out that old lady's score. I'm 34, <laughs> and I have two kids of my own. Move over, children. I'm just gonna roll. What the f Why does she make it seem like she's a thousand years old in this letter? She sucks. Could you look up Gail Gillett and make sure I, that she's not Oh, I am. I am. 
<laughs> Let's see, 34 and 90. So she'd be like 70, I guess. 65. Yeah, there's nothing. Medium.com? Is this is an art? No, it's spelled differently. She sucks. She sucks. I mean, I play more than my kids. Well, it's weird. They more than my children. All right. This wasn't really a disaster. I don't know why this was. Whatever. Uh, I. Yeah, it's been, this is a normal one. This girl just calls her. Uh, oh, she, has pet, she has Tanuki. I love. Right. In fact, I, I have two of my own. One is albino with white fur and red eyes. The other, which is black and brown, and named Tanuki. I think the one on the left is a fox. You idiot. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah. Her parents like, yeah, yeah, sure. It's an albino raccoon. Yeah, it's what a raccoon. What, it's what, albino raccoon. Just what, you know what? what? You know, Milo, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> My little reggae. I've been playing NES for four years. My cats have been playing for. Oh, jeez. Uh, I don't know which one is which. Is it the yeah, permanent yeah. team? Is still the one that she's talking about with the over here on the, on the left? She's got two raccoons on her lap. What a weird kid. No cat naps allowed. Yeah. All right. Oh, look at those two. Look at those losers at the bottom. Oh, shit. Sure. Oh, sorry. Pizza place in the background. Good lord. Partners Robert and Michael pose with a bigger than life Mario. Um yeah, he's just talking about how he's uh I, I, I don't know why. What, what loves Arkanoid. Here's our advice. What are you players. trying to rush to get to the turtles, you little nerd? Well, I didn't know it was coming next, and I saw it, but I was like, ooh, very excited. Love this. Love this drawing. Graphics and sound 3.9. I wouldn't. I don't know about that. Play control four, challenge four point three, theme and fun four. I mean, that's a little low, a little low, guys. Yeah, they're also trying to they're showing the NES and the arcade. Right, they're trying to compare. Like, look how it's the and same thing. They don't. And also, like, why don't you try to find the same scene? I mean, it is. What are you talking about? Well, it's four turtles versus Rocksteady, and there's yeah, one turtle versus Rocksteady. Yeah, they should have done the four. Also, they should have done the side by sides because it makes the arcade. It makes me want to go to a. A go kart uh, place and go play it. Yeah, I mean the arcade was perfect. Arcade was, it was excellent. Yeah, weren't those um, games just really? Did they were just quarter dumps? Like there was no yeah nothing behind it, right? Because it was like yeah. there was really no way you could beat the game without pumping in like four dollars or five dollars, right? About about yeah, yeah. So anyway, let's uh, let's dive in here. Wow, Don look at all them on their skateboards, the yeah. short skateboards and fat wheels. All right, Leonardo carries a katana, a long, sharp sword with a special attack and is a jumping slash. What does Don carry? A big stick, a bow. Leaping up and swinging the bow is Don's specialty. Raph's got a sigh. Mikey's got his nun Two chucks. short thorns and a wicked prongs. It's so I funny how... You know, it's so funny. They 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 spent the last like five issues being like, we have the four player satellite, and it wasn't even compatible with this game, which would have oh, been yeah, the, yeah. the most perfect game to do it for. Yeah. Yeah. I don't, I don't know. And also, why do they have the memory? MMC, like, isn't that weird? I, I have no idea what, what Ultra is. Soft memory 2M by 2M. Yeah. Like, who, what kid is like, well, what's the, what's the memory on this? What is oh, game the MMC3? Okay. Data box. This is all. I feel like that wasn't supposed to be there in print. That they just like left it by accident. Yeah, just I don't get it. Yeah, uh, the turtles. I don't have like it. Look moves. at that drawing. Look, look at these chubby turtles over here. What the fuck? Yeah. Look at this. Look how chubby they look. I don't understand. It looks like that they hired a child to draw the things. It's really crazy. Slash. That's not slash though. Um. Break the hold. One special attack. Dr. Stockman can't compete with a turtle who knows his moves. I don't... Very... Also, why does Raph have a penis? <laughs> Wait, where? Did he? Yeah. Go back to him fighting Baxter Stockman and look at his little peen. Oh, that's his tail. <laughs> Ew. It does look like a little turtle penis. Cowboy bunghole. <laughs> Stop. First level, let's fire. Let's save April. That's right. You should. <sighs> Road kill Rodney. This is a pretty awesome scene. One. I'm let's not going to lie. This is a fucking awesome rock steady drawing. Where? I love. Yeah, here. that's pretty great. I love this, actually. It's pretty that's great. Really, yeah, because he doesn't look looks pissed off. Oh, the stone warrior? 
General wow. Trey. Yep. Shredder is not amused. It's a great guy. Are you going way ahead? I, I, I yeah, love this. Kong. This cutscene's great. What when, cut Shredder, scene? when Shredder jumps out the window <clears throat> with April. Mm-hmm. It's a good bebop. Baxter Stockman. Yeah. Came to play this for I like when beer. Baxter Stockman was turned into a fly. He was. He was not happy about it, though. Tonight so I gross. died on turtle soup. And he's got April tied up. And he, so this was this was a brand new character they made just for this game. Tora? And, he, and he's never been seen ever again. Wow. Tora, this 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 uh like a wolf. The snow thing. Yeah, it's weird. It's like, like a wolf. It's a cool oh, it's, No Brian, yeah. it's an albino raccoon. Yeah. <laughs> it's a really cool villain, but he's never he would have been he would have been an awesome action figure. But yeah, they never the white wolf. Yeah, with, with like a cool spike leather jacket. But that was it. They never, they never made him. Who are you talking to? I'm positive. <laughs> Look who you're talking to. <laughs> Look who's talking now. They should like bring him back. I can see that one day they could just say, well, now, now that the Cowabunga collection is coming, I can see them maybe like doing that. Like, bring Let me ask back. you, Brian, what is with the B- BBF 610 MCF? <sighs> what is that? I have no idea. Mef McF KFHF. What the fuck? Very strange. It's. I feel like uh, half of the stuff is not supposed to be in here. It's like they printed it by accident. Oh, maybe. Yeah, maybe you're right. Maybe this is. <laughs> you know what? It, it looks. Maybe it's f- frame by frame. K frame. K frame. I might have said it early in the pages. I, uh, I looked back. I didn't. It's see so it. funny. Nine to twelve. Nine to thirteen. And, oh wait, hold on. Does it mean what type of enemies are there? Yes, knife foot. Yes, that's oh, oh. the Jesus, amount of this. Really? There's eight. Of, there's eight of those there. Like that's so crazy. Nine knife foot. So what is out of twelve? That's I guess the numbers is what confuses me. Yeah, I don't know what out of twelve means. I love it. It didn't even explain it. Yeah, it just didn't. Well, it does. Like you know, <laughs> you found it with dynamite foot, hammer foot, Mauser. That's so funny. All right, this, okay, Brian. So the next frame, there's gonna be three knife foots and a foot soldier. And you're like, okay, yeah. By the way, they all just did this. Like, there wasn't much of a. You killed them the same. But this guy's name is Graniter. I'm not sure why they call him the Stone Warrior. His name's Graniter. But what was he a general that turned to stone? Yeah, General Trag and Graniter were the two rock, you know, the stone uh, enemies. But he's got a name. Oh, he's got a name. <laughs> Man, the turtle van was so cool. I know, it's so Look, cool. I love this. Was Splinter on radio? Oh, he's holding a black belt. Feed <laughs> like, like, me now. It does look like he's about to like. Yeah, uh, I am here live. Uh, yeah, feed them. Live from the t- Technodrome. Um, extra I auditioned for one of the cartoons once. I was so excited. I, I got nothing. Did I, did, did I tell you I just emailed Kevin Eastman recently? Did you, my friend uh, Simon used to do freelance work for him. Fuck. He's doing a new show called Biz and Buzz. A new animated yeah. show. I emailed him to be like, hey, let me just audition for you. His his um assistant wrote back and said, well, let him know. So Oh wow. Hey, hey, it's something. Look, they put, yeah, I know. Hey, they put an extra turtle code in here. That's cool, right? Oh, up, cool. Up, left, left, down, 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 right, 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 B A star. You know what the best part is about you messaging his assistant? They're gonna message you back, be like, "Yeah, Brian, you can audition. Uh, it's non-union, and then you're yeah. gonna be." That's all right. I'll you're gonna be that. doing a fake name called Brandy McGuanis. That'll <laughs> well, be get, your, get, your fake name. This this Shogun Warrior is pretty cool too. He's a made-up guy as well. Shogun Warriors, and his head would fall off. Remember, you'd punch, you hit him enough times, his head would pop off. Ew, it's disgusting. Yeah, he was still. Oh, he was Vincent still, Von Growl. Yeah, Technodrome, coolest coolest toy ever. Just about. I never had it, but I agree. You've seen mine. You jizzed all over mine. I couldn't believe you had it. I know. The Stone Is Warrior. The other Stone again. Warrior? Not the same guy. Ah, oh, Jesus. No, he's wearing a different medal, I think. That's right. Okay, so this... Okay, hold on. This Shredder, by the way, is when they fi- when they first meet him in the 1984... Con- this is like basically a redrawing of that. And I love this drawing of Shredder more than anything in the world. I think it's coolest, most badass... Who would fuck with this guy, right? Um, 
really good job they did on this. And then it looks like in the in the arcade in the game though he was wearing a purple. He's tape. always between that purple and magenta, you know. <laughs> Look, Krong. It's Krang. One of the most underrated villains. He's a diabolical son of a bitch, Krang. I think Krang was like, really welcome, Shredder. He was an asshole, man. He was so mean. <clears throat> when was it uh, Dimension X? Yeah. Awesome. Did Kevin Eastman, this is, I feel like these might be it Kevin looks Eastman like himself. It. it is. Like, it's I'm very surprised. Unless they just, like, licensed it. They probably licensed it. Yeah. Kevin was too busy then. But, Turtles uh, 2, the arcade game. What a preview. What a preview followed by shite. Zick, zick, zick. Oh, yeah. my God. Uh, Howard's got a beam. Little, little Mega Man. I wonder if this power beam deletes emails that are sensitive <laughs> with me emailing children. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, what is this? Quantum Fighter. Never even heard of this game. Because that's a very, very problematic cover. Of a white guy dressed as a shogun. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty bad. The program calls for a hair raising action. Colonel <laughs> Scott O'Connor. I mean, I what watch the cuck? Oh, watch the claw. Ah, Brian, stop. I guess it's like a platformer, it looks like. I guess I never played it. Uh, I've never heard of it. Yeah, but where are the frames? Like, where are the K frames? K frame <laughs> five, K frame four. How many number? I need the exact number of enemies, please. Quantum Unit fighter. type Jabber Jaws is now the bottom, which was a character from Jabber Hannah Jabber. Barbera's Racing. <laughs> Jabber Jaws. We're getting into this is the fifth, sixth year of Nintendo now of NES, and it's like we're getting to that shovelware, I guess, right? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know how bad. I never heard of this game, so it's like it, it might be good. It's I never heard of it. Oh, shit. Robbie. So Robbie, where? Oh shit! Oh, I am no. evil robot called Robbie. Mm. My real name was Robert. <laughs> <laughs> I like how that guy's just looking down into the. Hey, scroll down. Yeah, he's looking into the pit oh, of fire. Shit. I left my wallet home. And no, Damn. The... <laughs> <laughs> Damn it! Now that I finished my quest, I have to go immutilate myself in fire. <laughs> right. It seems actually kind of cool. I may, I may, I may fuck with this a little bit. I mean, maybe. Let's just see. You know, let me know what happens. Yeah, I'll let you know. Classified Turtles. information. Turtles. Now I'm into it. Let's see. Bonus game location. Oh, I. Fuck. That's right. I remember that, but I forgot. I didn't. I forgot all about like. I keep getting. Spam. Oh my god! There's a Doctor Mario cheat. Um. What is this power up code? This was so cool. Okay, this is awesome. When you're low on energy during the game, you pause the game and do the Konami code and you get more energy. Oh, my God. That's it only cool. happens once per game? Maybe. Yeah. That's cool, though. That quick is cool. Reset. Quick reset. Yeah, there's a quick than, reset? I didn't know this. Quicker than pushing the reset button? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, what's the difference? If you're sitting too far from the reset, press select start A, B simultaneously. If you're right. sitting too far, I mean, like we weren't. <laughs> you know what I'm We're literally on a wire. What do you? It was mean? a six foot cord. I was yeah, right next to my... yeah. You imagine being on the. You couldn't even sit on the couch and play. Do you know how uncomfortable it was to play Nintendo at anyone's house? You had to sit on the edge of the couch, yeah, or on the floor looking up at the TV. And, yeah, or the floor looking up five feet from a burning screen in your retinas. Here we go. Was there anything? There was nothing good. Now we're just here. Yeah. Ew. Star oh, scroll right. over. Look at the old man. Like, Hello, Mike. Can you uh, find he, my medicine? My boyfriend. <laughs> Is he does he have an ice cream or like a Italian ice on him? I have a bucket of purple diamonds. <laughs> Hi, my name's Mike. I'm a baseball player from the mainland. My my uncle, the famous archaeologist, Dr. Steve Jones. Oh, Dr. He's, Jones, archaeologist. Interesting. Okay, Quantum Fighter. Oh, the other guy's name was like Steve O'Connor. This is Steve Jones. The most boring fucking. It's always boring. Generic names back then. Always just boring, just white dudes. Now I've got to explore the islands to find him. There wasn't much of a mystery. The game also, when you started trying to play it, it was like you're dropped in this map and to do anything was so stupidly dumb. Like everything was dumb. You know what I mean? Oh, oh hello. Oh, now there's my ex-wife. There he is. That's Chubby McGee. Yeah. 
You've got a yo-yo. Yeah, you had a yo-yo. That was like your 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 main weapon, right? In this game. Look at this guy. <laughs> we don't wear shirts here, Mike. Chief hey, how you doing? Or... My name is Mike Ditka. I got crashed <laughs> on this island on the airplane. Just want to know, did you bring any hot dogs with you from Chicago? <laughs> <laughs> tell you what i kill for a deep dish but all i've been able to eat was crab <laughs> <laughs> why don't you shake my hand because legally uh, there's no court of law it's under pirate justice and i can touch you <laughs> i can legally touch you <laughs> <laughs> oh man <laughs> master of the yo-yo you know this is the second game i know about that there was a yo-yo as a weapon what else was the other one like adventure island i think was uh one with the yo-yo or uh I don't think Hudson had, one. He had Hudson game. had like the Hudson. Yeah, 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 yeah. Axe. I forgot what else? The Island Tunnel. It's a cool snake. All right. Well, it's a sea serpent, you idiot. Sorry. <laughs> Robbie. <laughs> oh no, Robbie, hey, Robbie the robot again. I know. They're like, I am from Nintendo. Did you have one of those? A Rob? Uh, no, actually, my friend on the block did. I never had. I never saw one. Yeah, it was. It was so slow, but it was. A, it was cool. Yeah, you know, like this is all the mysteries. It just it wasn't. It might be fun to play with a guy. It's like not. A... I played no, it yeah. recently. My friend Mike is just like I was. I after like ten minutes, I was like, bro, I don't know. Like, yeah, these starts games slow. get boring yeah. so quick because if you don't know where you're going, yeah, it's always so you're hard. just that's, you're that's, like, I don't want to do this anymore. Like, it's how, that's how invaluable these were. These guides, you know. Well, it's also like. It's also the attention span that we had. Like when you're when you have no choice but to play this stupid game, you'll play it for two hours. But now it's like we everything is so done. Games are done so well. It's just like I have no patience for your dumb shit. I have no patience to tap A on every wall in a square to be like, oh, there it is. Like, oh, <laughs> shut up. Yeah, you had to. You have to find the hidden the hidden wall. Oh, it's awful. Big it's map. Fun. It's like a big map. There's a lure looper. Oh, let's see if we can find. Uh, I guess the skeleton ostrich isn't doesn't exist. No, that was just for the cover. You know, the things in the cover don't exist huh. in the game. I guess you're right. Uh, look, we got metal storm cover uh, poster. Ooh, now that what looks is? like. See, I would kill to have that. It looks like a transformer. He looked like a j uh, jet jet stream. No, I love that you hit the word trans harder. Transformer. <laughs> what? It was trans just transformer. You're like transformer. It's transformer look it's a transformer yeah yeah it looks pretty cool man game boy gremlins 2 nba new botch double dribble and Can't believe doing gremlin what is this this is how you're supposed to jump go to the page good where? lord where what do you mean the red line is showing like you go you oh jesus you you, yeah what the hell it's telling you the path to go my god you could can i tell you something brian it's a, it's a linear it it's a linear platformer like yeah. you'd figure it out oh, this guy funny. will drive you batty look this cutie will lure you hi yeah. can i have a spot <laughs> you have any room can i have a spot <laughs> <laughs> this cutie will lure you with kisses this guy will drive you batty this guy this this guy will do this this guy, this have... is like the remember i told you that borderlands 3 had the same joke where they would say uh, I want you to go find this guy from me, and and by find, I mean cut his goddamn head off. Right. And right, they kept right. doing that joke where it's like, I want you to a, and by a, I mean it was always like they right. did it, dude, like seven times in the third one. Yeah. So when I found out that the guys that wrote the third one wrote Tiny Tina, I was like, and they 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 snuck one of those jokes in, and I was like, are you are we are you kidding? Like. Oh, you unfunny. Mike Drucker nailed it with Borderlands 3. Why aren't you hiring comedy writers for your comedy game? And it's like, yeah, why aren't you? Why didn't you hire Mike Drucker or anyone else that's funny? Yeah. It's crazy. I don't care about basketball. It's I know. Crazy. We got a whole bunch of basketball games, though. Ew. So, look, look I, don't, at, I don't care. Look at this. Stuff. What is going on here? I, ah! <laughs> oh, my God. One dude's getting elbowed while the other one's doing a flying tiger knee into him. <laughs> is that Sagat? That's crazy. Yeah. Double dribble for the also, game. Also, the one basketball player at the top right on the page, I don't know if he's African-American or white who's too tan. He's very tan. Yeah. God, those shorts were so short. It was so disgusting. Beautiful. How did penises just fall out every three minutes? Some, some did. Ew. Some did. Batman. Were you ever excited when you saw it? Yeah. 
Oh, you're gross. Batman. Penguin War, Soccer Mania. Did you see the Batman speaking? I of? did. I loved it. That's very good. Turtles number one, as it should be. Revival replaced Mario Land. Good stuff. Coming soon. Game Boy Chart Key. What do we got coming soon? Mega Man for Game Boy. Next issue, Operation C. Yeah, that was the Contra. See, Man, if you just, hold on. If you just see that, you don't know that this is Contra, Operation C. You didn't know. Oh, yeah, you don't. Yeah. <laughs> Until you, I had it. It was great for Game Boy. But yeah. What we got here? We got Magician Mystery in a Realm of Magic. I, I would assume if you live in a realm of magic, this has plenty of mystery going around. Is this an RPG? Now, it looks like? Yeah. Well, cool. now we're saying this. Magician defies traditional game categories. Many elements are straight out of the role-playing levels of achievement, provisioning yourself with food and water, talking to everything in sight, etc. But you can also fight and move. Thank God you can move as in an action game, and there are mazes to solve as in a puzzle game. So what is magician? How about wow. simply calling it fun? Wow. Look at apparently not, because look at the rating it got. <laughs> not control, that good play control two out of eight it's not that no 2.8 it's not that good um this guy looks pretty lame i mean he's he's throwing a fart yeah he's like back Whoa. villains he's throwing an ice cream fart shay serena look you could you could, you could visit a brothel Ooh, oh my Fresh god Fresh meat. Oh, jesus hi yeah, this game looks pretty boring well, it's also just wait till you get to the image over there. Like, what the hell is this? Well, what the fuck is this? This looks like a gap model running from a fire river. Like, what? That's not a magician. That's like a that's a dude. Unless he's walking on water. Is that Dan Aykroyd? It looks like yeah. Nathan, uh, it looks like Nathan Drake. <laughs> yeah. What is? What um, is? It? I don't know. Look at the essential spells. Wakey, wakey. <laughs> Reveal light, fly, feather light. I, w I wish, like, in the heat of battle, he had to be like, uh, wakey, wakey. <laughs> <laughs> Go to sweep. Go Wait, to sweep. Is, uh, is this supposed to say moist? Where? What is this? Ew. Oh, yeah. What is it? Molest? Mjolst. Mjolst. Scroll. Mjolst. Mjolst. But then if you look over in the essential spells, so scroll left. Back into the left, up. Look, meow, meow. Scroll. Like what the fuck? Meow. I gotta play this game too. Fist shield, Axor seems like a lake shore. Ax yeah. Explore the guide. A lot of interesting games back then. It's just like again, like oh, Paul Pornhast, Mintast, <laughs> Mistnast, Mistnast. This is Pohamust. Look left. There's Pohamust. Yeah. Pohamust scroll. Oh, you're in different. Slow mo. <laughs> they had a lot of time on Magic. I, ne I never played this game. Abandons. I never Nobody, heard of this game. I, I, I know anybody who had it. Yeah, like they spent a lot of time on this. Oh. Here, scroll out so we can see the whole page. Power to the player. Most players use the power meters for comparing their favorite games, which has the best graphics, which is the greatest challenge, and so on. The same process of comparing games takes place constantly in Nintendo of America, where all the new games in development are played and evaluated. Okay, so people are like, how do you get your ratings? How do you rate these games? And they're telling them they're just basically uh, Mario 3, 4.5 out of, like, was 4.5 the highest? You gave your best game of all time? You couldn't even give it a full score. <laughs> Isn't that weird? It's so it's so crazy. Out of why, five. Why could you give it a five? It's it's Mario 3. It's one of the best. It is the best. Like it's ridiculous. It is the best. This is very Scientology over here. Meter readings, right? Don't say that. Now you're scaring me. <laughs> All right. Scientologist warriors. It's <laughs> sorry, Dallages who are warriors. <laughs> it's funny how they, they do like the behind the scenes stuff so much. Like, here's how we remember, like, like last issue was like the memory, how it worked, yeah. or whatever. How the yeah. save game, how many kids actually gave a couple? Look at Fat Babe Ruth, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. It's like a Looney Tunes character. Uh, I know, and you, got, and you got Popeye over here on the right. 
Pitching to oh, him. Oh, 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 do a good pitch. Ah, okay, 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 okay. When using the power meter to choose games, look for the one ranked highest in the areas that are important to you. Do you like challenge? Don't get bad news baseball. It I'm sucks. always to play control. Look at all these baseball games. Jeez. Base, base is all it was the best baseball game. I had that. So, Brian, what yeah. kind of games are there? I wish there was a way that someone could tell me the nine versions of games. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Do we want sports, adventure, role playing, arcade classics, all family action, game R and D? What's that? Research, Research and development? development? Yeah. Not at the, Ten of power like, and there's you. Only six oh. types of games. Yeah. Oh. All right. Well, there you go. Skeleton Warrior. Ultima. Ultima was like big back in the early, early PC days, but like, man, like, what yeah, the fuck? I, I never got into it. Yeah, I just don't get it. Moon Gates, Portals to Adventure. Moon Gates, Portals <laughs> to Adventure. <laughs> I think the way, sure. was, the way was scared. Yeah, this was an RPG, but also it lasted a long time and like as like an online game also, but not for me. It is not for me. Oh, shit. We're here, baby. We're here, baby. Oh, oh, did we? Oh, oh meet your destiny. Yeah, I don't care about Maniac Mansion. Counselor's Corner. Maniac Mansion. There How we, we go, Maniac down? Mansion. I like that we tease it. How do I want to say I, I like to tease Can we call the Meteor Police? What do we do? Mm. Mm. Speaking, oh, of, no. speaking of fresh meat, oh, here we go, we everybody. Call my. <sighs> God. Look at these handsome lads. My God, go to the Riddler on the top left. <laughs> what? Hey, everybody. What's Are up? You... Joe Lockett. Hey, Joe Lockett. I just hard like hard rock. rock. Commercial art. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Keep going. Black clothing. <laughs> Seattle nightlife. That's not a hobby. He's a he's a he's a goth kid. It's, no, he's not. He's smiling. Brian, did you finish Kickle <laughs> Cubicle without continuing? Oh my God. Kickle. Look at his Riddler shirt. Why does he have a Riddler shirt? Yeah, that's really pretty awesome. Joe Lockett. Oh he looks God. like a ba -da 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 -bamba. <sighs> Hard Rock. What is commercial art, you think? What, is, what do you think he means? What commercial art? What do you think is... he possibly means by that? What is commercial art? Is that like the the spot like the, the noid the tricks bunny yeah like what do you like about commercial i'm gonna commercial google art. commercial art because i don't hey my name's joe hey what do you have to do joe i like black clothing I like black clothes seattle nightlife have you ever sacrificed something sometimes i write down what i want on a piece of paper and i burn it in a ritual i Come love there. how the, i love how the goth dude loves kickle cubicle I know. Hard rock. Commercial art, art used in advertising. I mean, can you be any weirder? Hey, Ma. Wow. You know what I really like. I, like I like ads. Like I get like I could get some of it. Like I get like I could get behind that as like, you know, Caroline has some commercial art up in the house. You wouldn't list that as one of but your I wouldn't list it as a hobby. hobby. It's too weird. Just say art. Just say you like art. The worst when I, black clothing is the least hobbyist hobby ever. Yeah. Hey, what are you doing Friday? Wearing some black clothing. Yeah, but then what? Nothing. Do I do, Just bro. wearing my clothing and saying my Seattle not live. I might go out a little bit. <laughs> By the way, I use head and shoulders because if you have dandruff and you wear what I wear, you can say it so bad. I wear this shirt so girls ask me, are you like mysterious? Yeah. And, uh, and I say, <laughs> riddle me this. How many fingers can I get up inside you? <laughs> riddle me this. What's your favorite commercial art? <laughs> if you don't have one, then we cannot be friends. Riddle me this. Have you played Kickle Cubicle? <laughs> <laughs> what I thought you were going to ask me if I wanted to see Guar. No, no, no. Uh, no. Yeah. I'd rather play Kickle Cubicle. <laughs> <laughs> He's so strange. Is there like a, a big collar on the jacket or do you think it's probably his hair? Do you see it now? Where? <laughs> his shirt looks like it could be like a big collar, like a vampire, but I think it's his hair. 
Yeah, he doesn't have the widow's peak. Yeah. That's it. Okay. Let's go over to oh geez. Sean McGoldick. I like composing music. Oh Jesus. Is that, is that Hodor from Game of Thrones? Yeah. <laughs> oh Hodor. McGoldrick. 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 I completed Maniac Mansion without saving the game once. Man, I like Earthbound. You composing will. music, sketching, meditating, and performing. Would you like to come to the bar where my improv troupe is doing a short form show? I haven't sketched anybody in a while because all the girls say no to me. Joe, <laughs> why didn't you come to my improv show? I did. I was in the back wearing a black ski mask and black shirt and pants. But I actually didn't. I didn't enjoy it because it was during the day. And you I know also me. don't like things that are made up. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't like your improv because it was at 3 p.m. And you know me. I only like the nightlife. <laughs> He's got a big mouth. He has Andre he's, the Giant face. He's, it's a huge face. He's got giant yeah. cartoonish features. He looks he's like not, someone like, threw a face on a marble. He's not looking at the camera. Everybody looks at the camera. He's not. He's looking off in the distance. Uh, he's looking at like the camera man's assistant who's, you know, he's and he's, he's like, please be 19. Hey. <laughs> The whole this whole thing that we've done with the N N Nintendo Power, it's necrophilia and pedophile <laughs> jokes. That's all it is. Which I'm fine with. I'm sketching you in my mind right now. Yeah. Oh, something for the spank bank. <laughs> Make a deposit. This sweater's itchy. <laughs> yeah, that looks like a horrible sweater. Yeah. I I also have have you ever seen someone wear half a turtleneck? It looks like he hemmed his own turtleneck. <laughs> I like it just enough that it's not choking me, but I can feel it there. My mom always gives me hickeys in the morning, so I have to change. <laughs> I, have to, I have to hide. Would you drop three off at work? Ooh, don't forget mommy needs hers. Come here. <laughs> Meditating, huh? Meditating. That's not with his big mouth, he goes, oh, my. <laughs> He wakes, oh every, he, wakes, he wakes everybody else up that's trying to meditate. <laughs> oh, sorry. Sorry, I'm trying to meditate. He's in the back the whole time, <laughs> scratching his sweater. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, oh. I've, I gotta stop wearing wool to meditation class. Huh, it's 80. <laughs> that's good. Dude. Oh my God, terrible. Meditating and performing. Oof. Eric Carlson, nine years old. Look at this guy. <laughs> Eric Carlson, number one. You know how many times he, he corrects people because he's a fucking tool where they go, <laughs> oh, so it's E-R-I-C? <laughs> K? Oh, E-R-I-C-K? No, no, no. E-R-I-K. And it's like, oh, shut up. <laughs> Look at his Def Leppard shirt. Bro. I know, right? You, you like that. Hobbies. Well, his hobby. Brian, if your hobby was music, you would also wear a Def Leppard shirt. Def Leppard racing motorcycles he's dead eric carlson he's did not dead. he did yeah, not survive yeah. the 90s no no he think. he was like it, this is what eric looks like when he walks around this is my energy i got from him. hey man all right like he's one of those hey man all right oh cool cool, cool man you guys ever drink natty light and get on your motorcycle <laughs> yeah <laughs> i like to go fast he finished Ninja Gaiden in two in one hour and forty minutes. I wonder what the Ninja Gaiden two uh, speedrun record is now. It's probably like eight minutes. Yeah, it's probably eight minutes. This idiot was there for two days. <laughs> no, one hour, uh, fifteen minutes. So wow, go fuck he... yourself, Eric. <laughs> yeah, go fuck yourself. <laughs> Don't you play it with one arm like the drummer from your favorite band? <laughs> Garbage. Right on, man. I like his beats. Right on. I like Crystalis. Right on. Look at his Adam's apple. I think it's like shoving through his neck. Yeah. You know, I always thought I don't have an Adam. Like, I probably do, but it's like buried deep. You got, a fat, like, you got a fat neck. That's why. Well, the, <laughs> I don't think so, Brian. You don't have an Adam's apple that sticks out. Sure I do. do you really? Yeah. See? Well, your pop screen's in the way, but one of these days I'm going to flick it. Uh, oh, yeah, you can flick it. Oh, I can see it. I'll just wait. <laughs> I used to flick all the time. I used to flick. Dude, high next school. time, next time I hang out, I'm gonna flick you in the Adam's apple. I'm flicking you first. I'm gonna flick <laughs> you first. Hobbies: flicking and skiing. <laughs> <laughs> he looks so young. This kid. Skiing, racing. Eric, we said to wear your best attire. Yeah, I am, bro. 
I mean, this is my Sunday best. I never wear this shirt. I save it for dates and dinners with my mother. <laughs> Which is the same thing. I hate skiing. I would like skiing and I hate it. Yeah, it was big up there in Washington. All right, let's skiing see if we sucks. got David Nixon. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> if you saw David munching on a dead woman's face, you'd be like, all right. Like, yeah, you could again. <laughs> all right. David uh, Nixon, not related to Richard. <laughs> hobbies, auto racing, skiing. No. Everyone's wind, skiing. Windsurfing. Wind Interesting. First Best place in Days of Thunder. Hold on. That's not. That's that's just like playing a racing game. Number one, for. why is he dressed like one of the kids from the Peanuts? Yeah. <laughs> do, 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 do. Hold on. That's just getting first place in a racing game. That's your best that's accomplishment, a, David. Yeah, he probably sucks. You're still there? People hey, David, I am not a gamer. I've had people said that to him, and he's like, stop. I'm not related to Richard. And they're like, sure. He might be. He kind of looks like it. If that knows. He probably is. David Nixon. He probably is. That's How many funny. Nixons did you know growing up? None. Thank you. That's a he has the same look. He has the same pointy nose, lying eyes, and bad mouth, just like Richard Nixon. Perfect. I am not a crook. I, like I got first surfing. place in Days of Thunder. Auto racing, skiing, Watergate, windsurfing. I'm like, what? He's like, oh. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is auto race, like because he's got to do motorcycle racing up here. I know. Let's I'm race. Sorry, him, and he's got to say auto racing. Yeah. You bring your car. I'll bring my motorcycle. David. David, we can't just say racing. Like, be specific. Car. <laughs> I like car racing. Sounds like Richard Nixon the whole time. Uh, -da 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 -ba -ba. <laughs> He's wearing a Riddler shirt. That's great. It's I can't order. get over it. Can you see? You know who's concerned? Can you see the question mark? <laughs> Make sure the question mark is prominent. Remember along came Polly with Philip Seymour Hoffman played. Uh, yeah, that's uh, fine. It does look like right? Philip Seymour Hoffman. Just a nerdy fucking. Ugh, shut up. I'd love to Sean. see that guy in a wheelchair naked burning down the street. <laughs> what? Oh, it's, did you see Red Dragon? No. I hate your childlike movie things. You suck. What do you mean? <laughs> I, I can't make references with you because unless it's Sesame Street or the you Turtles, can, you're like, you can explain it. it. You can explain like a normal no, person. If you saw Red Dragon, like most of the world, you'd get it. I never even heard of it. But someone's like, Brian, this movie's a little bloody. You're like, ew. No, I, don't no. mind I don't mind bloody. I just, what the fuck? Dude. Have you ever seen Saw? Yes. A few I of them. Haven't. I have too. Mm. Want to play a game? All right. Okay, that convinced me. You saw saw. <laughs> yeah, Carrie always chops his foot off at the end. All right. And he's and it. he's the main guy. You saw it, or you read the cliff notes. I don't care what you saw it. Or as I say it, I saw it. And you saw it. Oh uh, yeah, that was from Red Dragon. I saw or saw. That's I how saw I say it. it in Long Island. I saw. I saw or saw. Yeah, Red I Dragon's great. Okay. Well, is Philip Seymour Hoffman in that? Yeah, he's in there. He plays a oh, newspaper. Okay. Uh, All right. A journalist who's like really skeevy, and then he messes with the main villain. And the main villain, like, he wakes up in his, it's so disgusting, in, like, naked in his tidy whiteies, taped to this old wheelchair. Nice. And then, like, you know, there's a whole scene between him and the villain. And then, like, you know, the villain's like, you know, will you not write lies about me? And he's like, I won't, man. I won't. And he's like, whatever you want me to say. And then mm. the next scene, you see a <laughs> a fat guy on fire in the wheelchair burning down a hill, just like, whoa, whoa. Like, it's crazy. It's like a Mac and me. It's excellent. Oh, yeah, yeah, like Mac and me. I feel like Sean always he's always playing the music he composed like on his computer on his Walkman really yeah. loud. People are like, hey, what is that? It's like oh, it's just just a little something I composed earlier. Sorry, it's, it's my hobby. It's <laughs> it's it, it's nothing. Did you hear Paul Rudd did the Mac and me bit on a Conan yep. O'Brien podcast? Yeah. Wait, I, I just I, yeah. I just realized he he has performing. Yeah, I told you that's why I was doing the improv thing. Right, but like just perform performing what though? I would love to know anything for my victims. I oh, mean, God. audience. Good, good, That's batch, I did, of, yeah. good batch of gents there. Good, camp, good, not great counselor's corner, but but good. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Joe no, Lockett good. really made it. Yeah. Definitely. Oh, every time. I know it happens. Joe Lockett really made it. We got some Zelda. What, why fucking That's Zelda? Legend of Zelda. Seven, seven years later? Did you never play Legend of Zelda and want to know where are the levels six, seven, and eight in the who's, second quest? Who's still waiting in 1991? Like, how do I beat this game? 
They open this up. Oh, thank God. Thank God. I was wondering how to get through the lost woods and lost hills. So what in the world? What is what is this? What a trip for four to FASA's Chicago Battletech Center. A special tour of duty in FASA's Chicago Battletech Center. You and three friends will experience the newest in high-tech virtual reality entertainment. That's VR back in 1991. Oh, my God. What are you talking about? Wait a second. Do you this sit what, in these things? This is what your underwear says. Beware of the blast. <laughs> Stop. Rescue. Yeah, I don't know. What, like, I guess? I guess you sit. Oh, my God. I was terrified. If you're claustrophobic, you did not do VR in 1991. I, I, okay, so you sit in there, and I guess you watch this monitor. It's not really VR. <laughs> Well, yeah. either it's not VR. No, you're correct. I guess you sit in the thing. They lock you one in. One part slides forward. They go, yeah, it's it seals you in, and then you're just you look at the monitor. Yeah, I guess it feels like VR because like you're you're in you're contained Does it move? in a place. It looks like it moves like around the room. Maybe I don't know. Pretty cool. I don't think so. I think it sits where it is. Okay. And that so the part that moves is see where it says rescue. Yeah. That pulls forward, and then you right. get in. And it goes. It, it air shuts you in. Jesus <laughs> Christ. You know how much yes. these were for arcades? $20,000. I know, right? That's why you never saw them. Man, that's why, like, it was the same thing when you look at arcades. Like, the, I guess if you're in a good location, you could, I don't even, we're, we're bef, I guess arcades, like, were they ever, like, lucrative? Was it lucrative for, like, seven years until Nintendo, like, ruined yeah. it? Yeah. Now you can't even find it. But arcades are just such, they're so niche things now. Yeah, yeah. Well, there you go. Ba 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 la bum bum. <laughs> Latest release. Shadow of the Ninja. Ski or die. I'd rather die. I'd rather play Crystalis. <laughs> Look at Vladi Divac. Wow. Ooh, Vladi Divac. I'm gonna read this later when we're done. Hooking it up to your TV is probably a simple task. You read the manual, plugged in, turn it on, and bleep zoop zap. <laughs> you could play quicker than. You could say Koopa Troopa. You don't do a video game with. You know, that actually sounds a lot like him. Did you know that? It's true. I mean, they're terrible. He's from Serbia. Every athlete should never be on camera, period, except playing no. sports. They should never no, talk. Stop, stop it. They should never be in commercials. You're such an idiot. They shouldn't uh, be anywhere. They're the do worst. Know, do you know AC Green's deal? No. He never had sex. That was his claim to fame. It was claim was he was a gross virgin. Yeah. He, he never got hurt. He played every game. And he never had sex. Was that his thing? Was he like, yep. he thought he lived in a horror movie? No, he just was very religious. Do you get that joke, though? That he lives in a horror movie? Because virgins don't die? Right. Okay, cool. Yeah. So saw, go. saw, huh? Did you? I, I, um, saw I, I saw it. That's crazy. Oh, look. Star Wars. Look, Adventure Island 2. I was just talking about this. Yeah. Double Dragon City. Just around the corner where the fudge is made. Bimmy and Jimmy. 13 years uh, of the most efficient release. Ooh, more f Super NES. Oh, they're in, oh, then Star Wars Nintendo game was so bad. It really was. It was dumb. Venture Island 2, I used to play a ton. Yeah, they're fun. Oh, my God. Double Dragon 3 is coming? Jesus. I remember. Bimmy, Bimmy and Jimmy. Did you see the Super Fan? Okay, yeah. The Super NES is on its way. Look at that. Look at that system. That That is not what we got. Yeah, that's cool. That's sleek. Wow. Wolverine ver and Terminator 2. The Wolverine NES game is complete garbage, unfortunately. But they're all garbage. Yeah. The Swordmaster, Nabunga's ambition. What's the game handler? A remote control unit, microphone, headphones, has it an interesting cockpit viewer. Although the controller takes a little getting used to, the motion sensitivity is pretty high. Sure it is. Yeah, right? <laughs> sure. The, sure it is. Why would you want to use that? I just, you can't. None of this works. No. They couldn't get the power glove to work. No, what makes some... you think any motion control is going to work? Now, let me go back to the bulletin board. <laughs> Wanted agents. Oh, man, we could have been an agent. Why are they reviewing Star Tropics? Can we get enough of Star Tropics? I know. Next issue, Star Tropics. We Why? just did it. Same shit. I don't want to care about it. Oh, Metal no, Storm, chapters, I'm in. It's chapters three through six. Metal Storm, yeah. I'm in, but oh, Jesus. Special report. Hardware. You know, Howard really is a herb because he wears a red bow tie and a white shirt. Yeah. Like he really drew, he really made himself out to look like a piece of shit every time he went somewhere. 
<laughs> there you have it, folks. Why are you sniffing so much? Jesus. <sighs> cocaine. Um, I don't know, man. Cocaine. Bloody, bloody, bloody divots thing. Well, there you go. You read this thing about AC Green. You're gonna get Here's mad at your wife for having sex with you. You're like, Here's oh, I'm gonna be a virgin. Twenty-one. There you have it, folks. TJ's got to go blow his nosy, and we'll be back oh, soon. Yeah. We'll be back next week for another issue, another episode, another epi of Videoizer. Videoizer. Bye bye. <laughs>